<sighs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Back today. Well, not your average uh, gameplay. Back up, bitch. Sit down, bitch. She, God damn. Oh god. Okay, alright, well, what else talk about? I kinda felt like playing the campaign of uh, Battlefield Hardline because um, if you guys did not know, I suck at Battlefield Black Ops 3. Oh wait, I didn't even introduce myself. Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dive. You guys, uh, you guys know me if you're subscribed, not subscribed, and you somehow stumbled upon my video, go ahead and click that button because, uh, I'm gonna be shooting for probably like two, three likes maybe? I don't know. Maybe a million. Oh, yeah, a million. I, uh, I was laying in, or yesterday, yeah, yesterday I was laying in bed, and I was thinking, you know, I had a really good idea. Like, I don't really have a lot of money, and I kind of want to get more horsepower in my car. So I thought of maybe, just maybe, a good idea would be... Alright, well, so, um, yeah, I don't have a lot of money, and I felt like it'd be a really good idea if I can, um, boost my car, because, uh, it's always... A little bit it's not easy to boost a vehicle but it's better if you really think about it because you don't really have to go through like um i don't know i felt like doing it but if you guys don't know i don't have a lot of money my dog god i can never make a video just a, a good a good casual video but yeah i don't have a lot of money and turbo kits cost 300 to 800 dollars depending on what kind of car you have and how much boost you're willing to put in your car so yeah i was not i'm not down to do that but okay, sorry god all right so instead of spending all that money for a turbo the kit maybe i can go to a local junkyard because i live in wisconsin and there's not a lot of like casually smart people out here so i thought i'll strip a turbo off of a car Maybe like a, a small stock turbo just for now. Around about 5 to 10 pounds of boost. And um, maybe if I can find an intact intercooler. I don't know if that, I don't know if it would be that easy. So I talked to my dad about it and he said that's a really cool idea to do. But why don't you just put a hotter cam in it and a better exhaust and maybe stronger heads. And um, I think that's what I'm going to go for. Turn a Camaro from an RS to an SS and that car is still almost finished. I'm doing some fender of it. It was really rusty so I could stick my whole finger in it. So we bonded over it and then we're going to like just feather it out a little bit. 